All right, everybody. Um, I built the turkey fencing. This is all material that we got from uh, one of our subscribers, Jenny. Uh, we got a lot of stuff from them. It's, we were really thankful for what they gave us. <laughs> But uh, this is for the turkeys. We put a couple dog houses in here so that they'll be able to get out of any rain or anything like that. We'll probably throw some hay in there for them too. Amy is duct taping the holes on the dog house to make it a little more weather resistant. We'll find another, a better permanent. Maybe I'll get some fiberglass and fiberglass them. But, uh, so that way they don't get rained on. Yeah, we brought their water over, their food over. We got a little thing here that they can roost on if they want. Um, but Where'd you find that? That was leaning up against that big oak tree. There's another one over there, too. Yeah. I found it when I was clearing this stuff out. But, uh, yeah, this chain link fence is fun to put up by yourself. Amy's been sick. So she was in the, in the house recuperating. She's come out since I got it done. And we're gonna try, go and try and wrangle some turkeys. Okay. Maybe I'll set uh, the camera up so you can laugh at us while we're trying to catch turkeys. Well, here they are. The turkeys are in their new enclosure. Um, now they won't spend all their time in here. We will keep them in here for at least probably two or three weeks so that they learn that this is their home. And then afterwards we'll, uh, we'll let them out during the day sometimes so that they can roam, get more bugs and stuff like that. So, yeah, they're not real happy right now. I don't know how much of the footage that you guys got to see yet of uh, us trying to catch them. The camera, the phone popped out of the stand, so...